Hello everyone, welcome to Stamping Within. Got a lovely project for you today for the uh, Stamp Around UK video hop. Make sure to check out all the other lovely participants and their gorgeous creations down in the description box below. You won't be disappointed. <laughs> now, the theme this month was monochrome. So, uh, I had an idea uh, when I first became a Stamplet demonstrator back in January 2016. I was already following uh, a number of uh, other Stamplet Up people, one of which was uh, Art for Stamping, the, the lovely uh, Ruth Magnus. Uh, um, in March of that year, March 2016, I cased one of her projects. Well, I'm now going to case my my case. So, uh, this is the card I originally did. Uh, picture there. And this is the card we're going to make today. Here we go. So, very similar. Uh, I'm using, obviously I'm using new stamps for this. Uh, we are using a lot of stamps from Tasteful Touches namely the the little squares and no actually we're using two no we're using three stamps on this set three yes three <laughs> those squares that gorgeous pattern there and the sentiment you are so special the other set we're using is very versailles lovely vintage set this and we're using the leaves and that little border there okay so a single layer card well double layer card i suppose with the card base and the matting layer but no no other layering it's just a, f a plethora of stamping and sponging so let us begin i'll put that up there out of the way hopefully you can still see it mm, yes you can just about yeah, you can see it you can see it now. So measurements and colours. We're using basic grey for the card base. This is half A4. So uh, eight and a quarter by five and seven eighths. Folded and scored at four and one eighth. We have an inside piece and an outside piece, which are both four by five and three quarters so we get a tiny little border around the edge there actually a smaller border than what I did originally so uh, let's do that first uh, let's do the inside bit shall we so color this is very vanilla sorry and we and the ink color is crumb cake so I'm going to do the inside first and get that uh, get that drying so we've got our leaves here And I'm going to stamp off onto some scrap and put that down the side here. There we go. Let the ink soak into the cardstock. Beautiful. That's the inside done. So we'll just put that over there and then we'll glue it in at the end. Now then, we don't need this bit yet. That can go over there but we do need this bit so first of all is to mask off this area here so i've got some scrap paper with a little bit of a adhesive and i'm going to bung that here about about an inch down like so and make sure it's level round that's our masking bit right first up sponging love sponging it adds so much texture to a card for very very little effort 
you get such a cracking effect. So there we go. Okay, that's the edges. And then I'm just going to go round into the corners. Lovely. Right. I've closed the ink pad, which you should always do, by the way, because you will get your fingers and cardstock in it if you don't. But I didn't need to, because we're doing the stamping now. So first thing to go on is our leaves. And I'm also gonna do uh, stamping off with this. Well, the first one will be full strength, like so. And then I'm gonna do another one afterwards okay and same again but I'll do it from the other side this time and then the second stamping there beautiful next we've got our little blocks I'm going to stamp these off like so, so they blend in with the uh, sponging. Okay, two of those. I've got the patterned one here. I'm going to stamp off that one, and that's going to go in this gap here, like so. This gap here. Beautiful. Now we're left with our last two stamps. So at this point we can take off our mask like so. The mask was an inch wide by the way, in case I didn't mention it. <laughs> now then. First of all, we have our border, which isn't a border in, in the sense of the work, it's going in the middle of this. Just there. Hopefully that's not on the squonk. It isn't. Bonus. <laughs> and then we have our sentiment, which we're gonna go, which is gonna go here. Hopefully not on the squonk. Beauty, beauty, beauty. So, I'm going to put that one up there while we adhere the inside of this. I've got my Tombow multi-purpose glue. Love this stuff. You've got to have the wiggle room. You know, I'm not confident enough to use tape runner because uh, I can pretty much guarantee it to be on the wonk. <laughs> this way it won't be. So here's the inside. Now you see, you see what I was doing there? Because I didn't close my ink pad. So close your ink pad and put it away. <laughs> it's the inside. And the same with the outside. Slap the glue on. You don't want it going anywhere. Um, put it on top. Is 
is what I mean about the wiggle room. Lovely. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, by the way. I should have said that earlier, although it probably came on the screen anyway. Uh, there's the one I made earlier. This is one I've just made. Don't forget to leave a comment. Uh, thank you so much for joining me today. Whatever you're doing or whatever you've done, I hope you had a lovely time and uh, I'll see you soon. Bye.